Good morning, everyone. Hope you're having a good day. We're just getting started. Now, here we have a control board. Not sure what it does in the machine, but it's part number CMC 12 POG space MEC. I wonder if MEC is like the manufacturer. But the complaint on this board is that it won't pull in the contactor. So, where do we begin? What I like to do is take my meter and set it on ground. These two outside pins appear to be ground. Let's double check that. Let's see. Yeah, they're tied together. Here's a 7815. The center pin is ground. Yes, that's ground. So I'm going to take my red lead on ground and just go down the pins we know that's ground just go down the edge connector pins and see if we see something strange and so far we have good diode drops Well, that's a little odd. 0 0.047 volt diode drop on pin 25 here. Let's make a mental note of that. We'll come back to it. Okay, so it's open. So that would be two sided edge connectors. This one, two, three. Three is open, 25. It's a low diode drop. Let's go to the other side. open. It looks like pin 4. That one's kind of high. Let's see, it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 in from the left. It's open. It's open. Okay, let's go back to pin 25 and we'll find out where that goes to. So it feeds through the other side of the board. It's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten in. Ten from the right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It's this one right here. Let's see if we can follow that trace. Hold still. Looks like it goes right here. Oh, that's it. I'm on the I'm on the edge connector and not the feed through. Yes, it goes there. This one over here is parallel to it. Goes there. Follow that. all the way up to the edge of the board. Looks like it goes right here. Yes, it does. Okay, now 
Let's go to the other side of the board. See where that goes. Let's double check ourselves. Yep. Okay, that goes between the edge of this. Looks like it goes over here. Yes, okay, and that's a HD74LS04P. It's a hex inverter. Let's so see if that's shorted in the picture here. Pin 7 is ground. Pin 1 goes to edge connector pin 25. Yeah, look at that. There it is, 0 0.046. That's shorted. This IC is bad. Pin 2 is shorted. Pin 3 is shorted. Pin 4 is shorted. Pin 5 is good. Pin 6 is good. 8, 9, 10. Okay. So we're going to have to remove that I see from the board and replace it. Now the easiest way to remove a bad I see from the board is just to cut the pins like this. Hold still. Okay, let's see if the short went away. ground black weed on 25 yes look at that now we're open so that I see is shorted something came in and damaged this I see once we repair this board let's go see if the if I can get on it because I cut the pins yep there it is that was pin one to ground so once we repair this board, they're going to have to find out what came in and pop this input. Get my tweezers. Trying not to heat them up with the soldering iron. Once we get the pins removed, we'll take our solder sucker and remove. solder from the vias.
package. go. Now I'll go get a nice C socket and a new 74 LSO4 and we'll install those in just a little bit. I'll be back. All right. I have a 14 pin IC socket. You know what? Let me get a picture of those traces while that IC is not installed. Just in case in the future we have to map more of that circuit. Okay. Let's hold on to that so it don't fall out. Wobble on me. I need to turn my iron up to compensate for the for the chill in this building. Solder don't want to melt very well. <laughs> okay, we got that installed. Now here's the new 74SO4. This one's by National Semiconductor. It's prefixed by DM 74LSO4N. Now, 
let's see what we look like. Twenty-five. Look at that. 0.546. That's good. It's not 0 0.047 now. <laughs> Something came in and popped that input. Now, I'm going to follow those open trace circuits, but uh, I believe we fixed this board. I just want to make sure that those open trace circuits are not bad either. There we go. Good job, folks. You fixed another one. I'm proud of you. Good job. Have you a good day. We'll see you next time.